Hello guys, Keep on TV here, back for yet another match preview. Before I get into this video, let's see if we can hit 50 likes. That would be much appreciated. By the way, thank you for your support on the Luton match review. We've got over 150 likes and I didn't think you guys could hit that target, so thanks. Thanks a lot. So getting on to Fulham, of course, Fulham, um, somehow they didn't play in the first round of the EFL Cup, which I find really strange. But yeah, they've had a flawless start in the Championship, winning three out of four games. They haven't lost a game in the Championship and are currently sit at the top of the Championship and goal difference ahead of West Brom. Um, for this game, I don't think Fulham are going to be taking it that seriously. Both teams are not really. Um, it's, it's going to be a weakened team from both both um, teams. I think you know we're not going to be putting out putting out strong teams for this game. I mean, the league is the most important thing that matters to both clubs. So yeah, I mean, I don't think they're going to be starting Mitrovic up top. So I don't really have to worry about that. I could be wrong, but. Getting on to Blues, of course, we beat Colchester 1-0, Oakley scoring um, the winner to take us through. Uh, it wasn't really a good performance against Colchester, but we was playing a lot of the players that you usually don't expect to see starting. So, the formation, Truman in goal, George Friend and Nico Gordon at the back. I'll go for 4-3-1-2 for this game. Oakley at right back after scoring that goal, you know, he's got to have it. He's got to start in this game uh, against Fulham. Castillo, Left back, the three in the middle. I'll go with um, Ivan Sanchez, um, Charlie Lakin, and uh, I don't know, um, probably um, Gary Garner. Gary Garner as the third midfielder. Then I don't think it'll be Chong playing in that camera, and I think it'll be Jordan Graham. But I don't know, it's because Lee Bowyer said in his press conference before the is I think he did he do one for Luton. But yeah, um, he said in his press conference that all the players were okay. So, I don't know, why is Jordan Graham not even featuring on the bench? Is it an injury? Maybe he's back for this game. He, of course, he played in the first round against Colchester. So, Jordan Graham in that cam roll and the two up top, and Ike and Lecco. I know, I know Lecco is appalling, appalling to say the least. But, you know, it is a cup game and it's a chance to... It's a chance for him trying to try and get a goal in this um, game. And EK, of course, got his first Blues goal um, against Luton, scoring the fifth goal. Really happy for him because I think Anike can do bits. He got 15 goals for Charlton last season. But yeah, the second round, Blues, Fulham. I think I, I think Blues will edge it, you know. I think it'll be a nil-nil draw and it'll go to penalties and we'll win on penalties. And I think it'll be a really poor penalty shootout. I just don't really see many goals in this game. Nil nil, and then we win on penalties, and then that will take us. If we do get past Fulham, that will take us through to the third round of the League Cup, and of course, that's when the big teams start to come into the draw. So, do you, so do you think that we could go on a cup run? Do you want to go on a cup run, or are you more interested in the league? To be honest, I wouldn't mind a good cup run. I know it's not in the FA Cup, and the FA Cup is much more prestigious than the Carabao Cup, but the Carabao Cup, you know. We've got a history with that competition. We've won it twice. Um, so, yeah, I mean, why can't we go on a cup run? It's the look of the draw, really. But, yeah, like I said, I'm going to go for nil-nil and for us to win on penalties. Let me know your thoughts down below on the game. Uh, are you going to be going to it? And also let me know your score predictions for the match. Anyway, it's been Keeper on TV. Make sure to like, share and also subscribe to the channel. Anyway, keep on time. See you later.